So we're very happy to see that we're starting to receive the data and we got the first image uh, taken during the descent. The image was taken at a distance of about three kilometers from the nucleus and this is it. On the top side we see uh, a, a leg of the lander which is in the field of view and uh, as I said the size of the uh, comet taken from three kilometers is about three kilometers in size and uh, we have a resolution of about three meter per pixel. The landing side is exactly in the middle so we can confirm that the trajectory was correct and we had a safe landing. Some of these data, also Roma, um, indicated that the lander may have lifted off again. We touched down, we are rebouncing very slowly because the landing gear worked perfectly well and it was designed in order to damp the majority of the impact energy. What we saw in the coming about two hours was fluctuation not only in the RF link but also on the solar generator which could be interpreted, again, don't cite me, that's what it is, could be interpreted that the lander lifted off and started to turn itself because the flywheel was switched off at touchdown, so the lander would start to turn. About two hours later, this information of turning on the power generator stopped. We still got radio link, we still get science data from there. So maybe today we didn't just land once, we even landed twice. <laughs> To know if a mission is a success, I don't need to look at computers or don't look at data that I don't understand. I am just looking at the smile of Paolo and uh, Stefan. And when they are smiling, it means that this is a success. So it's a big success and it was a great day. Thank you very much.